Hello everybody, this is Theron. Welcome to the Minecraft 1.9 Snapshot Tour. And of course it's starting to be dark, so of course it's starting an episode now. Oh, let's go check on the sheep, because uh, we have a new snapshot. This is a 16W06A. Hello skeleton horse, you're still there. You should belong in here. Oh, dang it. Dang it. Oh, okay. It's getting used to this new trackpad. Okay. Hi, uh, hi, Mr. Mr. Sheep. Let's take care of you. Um, so, that bug that was like the best thing in the world that they fixed, where entities no longer glitch their way through fences. Yeah. Um, that, that's been broken now for a little while and it's annoying it is annoying indeed so uh hello whoa oh geez come here come in come inside here there we go uh so it seems like the sheep i think what's happening is there are sheep who uh when i log out are near a fence like these guys near a fence like maybe like this blue guy slightly intersecting the defense's hitbox hi i don't like you being there but at least you're still inside the fences uh there's nobody in with the, the cows and uh when so what happens is when i log in i'll often come over and there'll be a, a sheep like half in and half out of this fence here he's Whoa, that's really sensitive. Oh, interesting. I wonder if I can adjust the pressure sensitivity. Um, that would fix it. So I have to come over here and then push them back inside the fence. And sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't. Okay, let's go put this stuff back. Sun's starting to go down. I'll go to sleep. And uh, we'll, we'll talk about a couple things here. So this... Uh, uh, entities escaping from fences is still a thing that was fixed for a while but it's been broken for several snapshots now oh goodness ah, and it's annoying and it's, it's frustrating and I'm not quite sure what to do about it they changed a lot of the noises the, the iron doors now have a really wimpy little tinky sound which is kind of annoying nine emerald blocks that's like all the emeralds I have in the world except for the one in the item frame and the placeholder here. So I've got, uh, what is that, 9 times 9, 81 plus 2. So I have like 83 emeralds. Um, that's what we're going to be talking about. <sighs> oh, look at the iron golems dancing over there. So I wasn't... Uh, Snapshot came out yesterday. Today is Thursday, February 11th. Um, I was at work late last night, so I didn't... I didn't... Uh, when I got home, it was too late for me to... get on and record any. Hello, Mr. Burning Zombie. Can I get to you before... you burn to death? Nope. Okay. Arr. And you didn't. Oh, you dropped some flesh. Pick it up. And uh, tonight, the missus is out with friends. So I decided to get on. I wasn't going to, but uh, I decided I may as well take advantage of the, uh, the relative quiet and the time. And do a couple things here. I'm planning on. This is working pretty well. I still haven't figured out sort of optimal distance, but obviously when I'm over there, it seems to work pretty well. So, uh, rates aren't super huge, but, whoops, no, there we go. That's what I want, and I'll put this up in there for now. So, I've got a bunch of bones. 
from skeletons falling from the sky. And I need emeralds. So I figured let's uh, let's go do something about that. Oh, sorry about that. So, <sighs> oh, one thing when I updated to the snapshot, the mob farm stopped working like se severely stopped working. Um, and I had to go up there and take a look at it and I couldn't see anything wrong. The hopper clock had just stopped working. It didn't overflow like the one down there does every now and then. It just stopped working. And I had to break pieces of it in order to uh, make it work again. So I had to break it and re rebuild it. That's what I did and started working and everything's cool. The uh, the one with the sugarcane farm did not break. So I don't know if I can blame that on the snapshot or what, or just a loading thing, I, I guess. It used to be a thing where hoppers would load weirdly when you load it up. Sometimes there would just be errors and they wouldn't load correctly. Or if they were midway transferring something when you logged out, they would be in kind of a hung state. I don't know. There's still some issues though. Um, in the and much hay is being made about um, hidden date, secret date, in the blog post on the, this snapshot. If you look at the data values of the walls that are in the screenshot it suggests that next Wednesday it has the date of next Wednesday in it and Mojang said they're getting close to a pre-release so it's not like 1.9 is going to come out next week but it's possible they may decide to switch to calling it from the from a snapshot um, and change it to a pre-release so we'll get 1.9 pre-release 1 next week. Possibly, I don't know. It seems like there's still enough problems. They say that they, they have fixed the nether portal or end portal bug. But people are still complaining on the bug tracker that it is there. Um, they have tweaked boats, which is nice. But apparently there are still some issues. I haven't even played with them. Um one of the previous snapshots the boats actually worked on land which is awesome i wish they would actually leave that in <laughs> obviously they're not going to boats are supposed to be used on water but having having cars effectively would have been really kind of cool and i've seen some modded mine um, minecraft that used uh, not boats but used mine carts <sighs> hi mr carrot why don't you go back in the ground I'll waste even more bone meal making you grow. There we go. Thank you. Oh, okay. What else is new? So sounds, the witches, the witches sound pretty cool. Um, so yeah, they've, they've swapped out a lot of the sounds. Slayer looks good. And... Yeah, so I'm kind of, the reason I need emeralds is I'm kind of really stinging from losing all my stuff. Stupidly stepping into the, the void in the end. So I'm still trying to get my stuff back into shape. I realized that my, my sort of lame, in theory, temporary XP farm, which is that spider farm, uh doubles as a string farm because it's it's a uh, it's spider spawner so I had been dumping out after killing spiders I would dump the string out into a chest so I had a bunch of string so I went and grabbed that and I had a Fletcher in the village so I unloaded all the string on him and got a good number of emeralds that way but, uh, and that's useful because the, I didn't, I don't, it's an XP farm, but prime, the primary purpose of it was so that I could repair my mending gear, uh, 
But now almost none of my stuff has mending, so it's all picking up as XP. And then I'm immediately enchanting stuff. Oh. Oh. Gotta get you over here. Um trying to trying to get a head start and then a combination of enchanted enchanted tools and weapons and such with uh books that I get from the the villagers. But I don't have all the villagers I really need. Okay. That should be good. Okay. So let's go uh let's go harvest here and I thought I saw something out of the corner of my eye. <sighs> um as I said I'm not feeling particularly well. The not feeling particularly well in this case is um may well be MS related. I'm feeling a little what I call funky, it's hard to describe. I'm not really feeling lightheaded or dizzy, which is kind of the traditional symptom, but just feeling kind of kind of out of sorts. My head is definitely unhappy. Oh, Mr. Carrots. Um, and it, it may be related to that. I need to go in and see my neurologist. And we did a MRI not that long ago, but she may decide that she wants to do another one just in case, which is fine. I don't mind the MRIs. It's just a little bit of a hassle. And it's kind of annoying that that is swinging a big magnet around my brain is literally the only way they can tell. Oh, hello, dude. Oh. He's not even pointing at me. What's going on here? Ah, that's that's interesting. I would call that a bug. Okay. Oh, I saw black stuff falling. That's what I thought I saw in the corner of my eye. I do see things sometimes. Like a little shadow will catch my eye and my brain will fill it in as being something else which is a little bit disturbing um, so it's, it's a little it's a little disconcerting because they'll see it and like oh my gosh there's a mouse or something and, and of course no it's nothing it's just a shadow um, so ooh poison potatoes I like poison potatoes I wish they had a purpose in the game Okay. Seeds I can leave in here because I don't need them just yet. Come on. It's starting to get dark again. Okay. Is that the end of it? No. There's still more. The chest sounds are also kind of wimpy, like the, <laughs> they sound funny, uh, like the, uh, the iron doors, they just don't seem substantial enough. I think they had a, a stronger sort of feel to them before. Okay, let's wait here until the sun goes down and we can uh, hop in bed. It's getting late. Can we sleep yet? No. Oh, here's, here's an interesting change. When the sun finally goes down. Come on. See, we're holding the sword in our hand here. Oh, come on. That looks set to me. Okay. There we go. Look, I'm holding the sword upright, and it's weaving around. That's kind of weird. Um, so whatever you hold in your hand, it does that sometimes. Other times, it kind of displays a weird partial thing. I don't know if that was them trying to fix it or not. Instead of trying to add little visual stuff like that, it would be better if they like implemented, you know, slabs and stairs of all the new stones, the new, the the one point eight stones, the andesite and diorite and granite and stuff, and uh, slabs and stones, slabs and stairs of other stuff. Hey guys, yeah. Okay, so I don't necessarily need to see all this, but 
We've got, uh, oh, I didn't get very much wheat out of that, did I? Oh, that's fine. Huh? Uh huh. Oh. You already locked up? Jeez. Okay. Okay. So, anyway, that's kind of, uh, you're going to refresh, right? Yeah, thank you. Okay. Well, you don't really need to see this. I'm just trying to get enough emeralds to buy a bunch of books um, uh -huh. so I used to when I was trading like this I used to like every, between every trade exit the GUI and uh, wait to see if he would refresh but it is apparently cumulative I'm not locked why aren't you letting me trade or maybe you are locked and Interesting. So if you can get in five trades with them, you're almost guaranteed to uh, to get, uh, get get a refresh because each trade you have a twenty percent chance um, of getting a refresh. So if you can get, uh, get in five trades before. Uh, everything locks up then uh, then you have a been you're basically up to 100% so now both the the two trades that are useful to me right now the potatoes and carrots are locked but if I back off he will probably unlock there he goes give me the green that's interesting but he's unlocked so that's all I care so so anyway Huh. Huh. Okay. Well, I don't have much else, but I got 38 out of that. So, so anyway, I'm going to go, I'm just going to grind a little bit, trying to raise more emeralds, dump off this stuff and go, uh, grow more, grow more wheat, maybe spend time at the XP farm. And, uh, you don't really need to see all that because it's kind of boring and there's not too much else going on that I really am concerned about uh, there are other changes but they're mostly bug fixes and they're mostly uh, mostly minor so I'm not uh, too concerned um, and I've been mostly just trying to get my stuff back so that's that uh, I do have um, a couple other things I'm trying to do with Minecraft right now and uh, I'm probably gonna record uh, record video. Oh, these are all grown up. Oh, good. Yay. Oh, except for you. But I got some bone meal. So we can do that. We can take care of that. Boop. Uh, so I'll probably record quickie little update videos on those. Oh, and you. That's right. I saw this one before. Boop. There we go. Cool. Uh, so I'll probably harvest this. I have the stuff down in the basement as well. Um, I have a row of beetroot plants which are kind of pointless. I don't think the villager will take it even. So I probably for the time being will dig up this and replace it with probably go like, you know, jeez, oh, this trackpad is annoying me. Potatoes, carrots, potatoes or something. And then we and bone meal it all up. Maximize my utility here. Or maybe just because the weed isn't that useful. Um, but anyway, you don't need to see that. It'll be fairly boring and and so on and so forth. So, uh, thank you for watching. Have a good day. Hope you're doing all right. And uh, I will see you next time with a, another Minecraft 1.9 snapshot tour video. All right, bye.